Welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we're going to show you how to create a custom header and footer using Elementor and the Astra theme. Let's get started. Custom headers and footers can give your website a unique and professional look. Today, I'll guide you through the step-by-step -step process to design your own using Elementor and Astra. Let's dive in. In today's video, we will be creating a custom header and footer to replace the default header and footer. This process will work on any theme. Let's start by installing the Astra theme. Go to Appearance and click on Themes. Click Add New. Search for Astra. Install and activate it. Next, we need to install Elementor. Go to Plugins and click Add New. Search for Elementor. Click Install Now and then Activate. For this tutorial, we will be using one of the basic Astra starter templates. You can watch one of our other Astra theme videos on how to install and configure Astra starter templates. To create custom headers and footers, we'll also need to install the Elementor header and footer builder plugin. Go to Plugins, Add New, search for Elementor header and footer builder, click Install Now, and then Activate. Once the plugin is activated, go to Appearance and click on Elementor header and footer builders. Click on Add New to create a new template. Select where you would like your custom header to be displayed. You can select individual pages or choose the entire site option. For this tutorial, we will be display both the customer header and footer site wide. Name your template custom header and select header in the type of template. Then, click Edit with Elementor. In the Elementor editor, start by adding a section. Drag a section widget into the canvas and choose a two column layout. Create an additional column by duplicating the left column. In the left column, we'll add the site logo. In the middle column, we'll add the menu. The right column, we'll add the navigation menu and social media icons. Adjust the logo size, the text color of the menu, and the item's alignment as needed. Customize the header's background, padding, and spacing to ensure it looks great. You can also add additional elements like a search bar if needed. Once you're happy with your header design, click the Publish or Update button. Click the Exit option to exit the Elementor page builder. Now, let's create a custom footer. Go back to Header Footer Builder and click Add New. Name your template custom footer and select footer in the type of template. Then, click Edit with Elementor. In the Elementor editor, Start by adding a section with multiple columns to accommodate different footer elements such as contact info, social icons, and navigation links. Drag a text editor widget into one of the columns and add your contact information, including address, phone number, and email. Next, drag a social icons widget into another column. Add links to your social media profiles and style the icons to match your site's design. In another column, add a nav menu widget for footer navigation links. This can include links to important pages like About, Contact, and Privacy Policy. Customize the footer's background, padding, and spacing. Add any additional elements like a copyright notice or a newsletter sign-up form. Once you're happy with your footer design, click the Publish button. In the Display Conditions, select Entire Site to apply the footer across all pages. Now, let's preview your site to see the new custom header and footer in action. Make sure everything looks great and functions correctly. Test the responsiveness of your new header and footer on various devices, including desktops, tablets, and mobile phones. Ensure that all elements are properly aligned and functional. That's it for today's tutorial on creating custom headers and footers using Elementor, Elementor Header and Footer Builder plugin and Astra. By following these steps, you can give your website a unique and professional appearance that stands out. If you found this video helpful, please give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and hit the bell icon to stay updated with our latest content. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.